Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy. Nope. I'm. I would. No. I will never do. I will never do a re uh, introduction like that. Hello, everybody. It's me, Vegan Luke. Today is figure collection. I haven't done one of these since 2015. So I'm going to show you all my figures today. Let's hope I don't drop any of them like this, buffoon. Games that were released only on the Philips CDI system, and there are one of the few instances where Nintendo has allowed these games to be. Imagine being in the Guinness World Records for most computer games ever owned and you drop a computer game in the video and they still kept that in. Just thought I'd throw that in for you. But we're gonna show you, um, we, just me, I'm gonna show you all the figures I collect. I collect quite a lot of figures. Uh, this isn't everything, there's all around the room. Uh, first of all, to show you some stuff, there's some stuff on the floor down here. Um, not on the floor, this, this. I'm just gonna show you this box. This box is full of just all, like, um, like. This is full of, of Simpsons, Series 1, Lego, um, some other Lego figures. Um, I need to get these out at some point, but I don't have space up here for some stuff, so they've just been kept in a box. And then we have um, some Pez. We've got all the Incredibles Pez. So we have Mr. Incredible, uh, Miss Incredible, Jack, um, and why have I forgotten? Speedy Guy. Forgot his name. That's what we're calling. We've got Batman Pez. Uh, we got Mike Pez. Uh, we got Fix It Felix. This was on some drink thing that I got before. It's not really a figure, but I'm sure we're going to class with figures. We got Wreck It Ralph. Uh, we have a Transformers stress ball. Um, we got another uh, Mike and Wow. Forgotten his name. It's good. Monsters Inc. Um, them. Ben 10 one and a, and a Kermit Pez and now I'm going to show you the shelves over here. Did you just remember the Monsters Inc character? Remember his name is Scully. Why the, I don't know how I forgot that. It's one of my favourite films. And um, this is a lot of random stuff. Um, I collect quite a lot of movie related stuff. Um, but I'll show you all this. So first off, we have I can't remember what series this was, but this is the the Disney. Uh, Lego, which is, we've got the Alien, we have Hook, we've got Mickey Mouse, then over here we have Rocco from Rocco's Mod's Life, that is one of the new Kid Robot uh, Nicktoons they've released. Um, forgotten this series, but this was a Kid Robot series, I used to just go to the Kid Robot store when it used to be in London and buy lots of random figures, so these were something town, nice, nice town or something, I can't remember, but see, we've, we've got these and it goes up to here, it was all those, those six are the same with the part. Same series, and then we have Bear Brick. The um, well, that one I can't remember. That is the King Row one as well. That's one of the Dunny ones, but I can't remember what that's called. But a lot of Bear Brick, just random ones. Uh, this gold one. This is one of my favorite ones. This is made of, of felt, so it's, it's quite cool. That is a Prodigy one there. Um, that's from I think that might be from series twenty something. A Minecraft one with Batman. A uh, random Japanese one. Uh, this is up. This is from this is one that has up written on the front of it. Uh, it's because it came with the Kubrick one, which is Carl over over here. But we'll get to that shelf in a moment. Then we've got this random one here as well. And then we have Snoopy. We've got Daft Punk one, a random see-through one. And then this was the Lego uh, Halloween series. They've all out, out loads of different Halloween things. We have the Mini Mates Clerks. Well, this, no, this isn't Clerks. This is Jane Silent Bob. But this is from Jen Sorry but Bob Strike Back Mini Mates released a version of that. And I'll show you my clerks ones, black and white ones I have later. We got some Lego Batman back there. Uh, this is another one in the Halloween Lego series. Uh, we've got the mystery machine there. Uh, here we go. Uh, Mr. Poopy Butthole. And some random zombie back there. I'm not gonna pause because I know I know stuff will fall off. So we got Ram back there. Uh, then this is Dogbird. There we go. One of the Garbage Pail Kids. Um, this random snail that I got a toy con the other week uh, from Creature Creature Stall. Um, then we got Ash from Ash vs Evil Dead. Got Slimer. Um, got the Blue Ranger from Power Rangers, the newest film, Mars Hacks. Uh, then we have Jason, Freddy, uh, Ghostface, Michael Myers. Uh, I have a lot. Of, I have quite a lot of Funko Pops, but I, I collect more of the ones that are horror and that sort of stuff. So over here we have Stripe and Grenda, and then we've got the Stripper, um, Stripper Gremlin, um, then Zor. Why well, am I forgetting his name as well? That's another one, the Halloween Lego thing. I don't know why. I've hidden Incredibles one right behind there. He was in the Disney series as well. 
Um, then we got up here, just some random cat. I think this, I can't remember what series this was, but it was just a blind box I got, and you've got poop next to it. This is another one that I got from Toycon uh, the other weekend. So it's a very, cute, very cute shark. Uh, then we have Lucy, uh, Charlie Brown, Woodstock, and Snoopy Pez. Um, Ursula, this random little thing here that I got from Toycon a couple of years back. Then the bomb from Mario, and then we have Heimlich from Bugs Life. Oh, there we go. Dropped it. Nintendo. And um, because I am very silly. And I didn't realize at one point that Pop Funko Pop boxes had actual plastic things in them to put on the feet. Um, I do realize now because there's that's on feet and on some other feet. But this one, I never saw it in the box. Uh, I think it was through the box. I never saw it. Yes, I take my Funko fig figures out the boxes, which I know a lot of people don't agree with. Then we got Flick and let me put down those. We got Flick and Pinocchio. Uh, Pinocchio, this is like the Medicom, I think Medicom figures, but I got this for £3 off of eBay when I was just randomly buying figures off of eBay. So we move on to this shelf, which is some Disney stuff. Uh, so we've got Carl, the front from up. The thing I love about him, he actually has his little grape soda uh, pin on. Then we've got Buzz Vinylmation, uh, the baby from Toy Story 3, Squeaker, Aladdin, the guy from Wally, -E, and someone from Haunted Mansion from The Bride. Uh, they made a load of Haunted Mansion. Uh, Vinylmation at one point Disney did. They, a lot of those are from when I went to Disneyland Paris. Uh, then this shelf is more of like a, a Halloween type bit. So we've got um, Sam from Trick or Treat, and then Sam again from Trick or Treat. That's the uh, Funko Reaction figure, uh, and that one was just the uh, Horror Blind Box figure. Uh, then we have Christian the Black Lagoon, which is another Funko Reaction. Uh, then we've got Michael Myers, and a random Android figure that got released, which I found in a charity shop. And this is another one of the Medicom figures that they released, which is the same design as the Pinocchio one, uh, and this was a random £3 eBay buy as well. And here is the the Alien shelf, so this is the Kubrick um, Alien figures first, uh, which there is more. Um, I'm not going to move these because, of, annoyingly, these figures, these ones here, the Super 7 ones, always full, but there's a Kubrick figure here, um, then there's that's another Kubrick one, and if you can see... Right behind, we have another Super 7 figure, which is that guy back there. Uh, then we have, uh, with the chest burster, which is um, Titan figures. And then you can see there is Ripley in a space suit back there. And then we have another Super 7 back there as well of the Xenomorph. You can see it's, a, it's the, uh, mighty, the mighty figures they released, which are all the really little figures. But then we, I just love these figures. I love all these, because I, I had that one first, which is Super 7. And then I got these two and I was worried because they were blind boxes I was going to get the same. But there's a brown one there. And this one is the blood spatter blue one which is awesome. Over here we got some uh, kid robot and South Park. There we go. All of those there. Then we got Futurama. It's Fry and Leela. And um, we have Lemmy. Lemmy. I think it was Lemmy Whip from uh, it's the little name of the little mouse that grows up his ass in South Park. He came with... With him over here, we have the Simpsons shelf. This is all the kid robot Simpsons figures. Um, there's quite a lot here, and then over here we have another one. There's there we go. And um, these can't remember what company these are from, but there's all these really cool Bart Simpson ones, which are skull ones. So we have that one, uh, that one there, and then this one that's a little bit hidden back there, but that's another cool one. And we have a Marge Simpson Pez. I went a bit Pez mad on eBay and <laughs> found her. Uh, then we have a couple of the Lego Simpsons. So we've got Millhouse and Homer. Then here we have Boris from Bendy and the Ink Machine, which is one of my favourite games that I've played in a while. If you haven't played it, then seriously, check out Bendy and the Ink Machine because it is amazing. Uh, There's just a random pin here. Um, I'm not sure the pit from the pin crowd when they made. It's meant to be Old Dirty Bastard and Grandpa Simpson mixed together. Uh, then we've got up here, which is more Pez. Um, so we've got Muppets Pez, uh, Lonington's Pez, and some random... Random... Pokemon figure. I forgot what he's called, but I found him on the floor in an arcade. He just went out of the arcade machine. Someone hadn't picked him up, so I, I took him. Uh, then we have some more Lego figures. Um, some, two of the newest ones I got from the Lego Movie 2. Uh, I love this watermelon one here. And then that's another Halloween one, and that's also from that one there. It's from Lego Movie 2. Then we have Kermit Funko Pop. Um, Jigsaw figure. Lard Lad figure. Let's get a one. Uh, we have this Unikitty, which does, which came with the 
this is the Lego Movie 2 blind bags they've released. But then my girlfriend found this one here when she was in Berlin recently. For some reason at the airport they had a whole Unikitty series which I haven't seen in the UK. Uh, then we have some Pennywise figures, this is a Funko Pops. Um, there's one without the boat but I got the one with the boat. And the spider, spider claws there. Um, then we've got Breaking Bad figures. So we've got Gus and Walter White. Um, that's when he's, you know, dressed up as, that's when he's Heisenberg. Uh, he's got his money, he's got his gun. Gus is, is um, Las Polos, little bucket. Um, then there's Walter White here, you know, when he's in the meth lab. Uh, Walter White is meant to have glasses, but someone was at mine before, put the glasses on the wrong way around his head, and they broke. Uh, so, it's very annoying. Uh, you can see Walter White Jr. back there. It's one of the Titans figure. You can also see the van. It's Jesse, his little mask. Mask does lift off, please do not fall. Let me just take take him down and show you him. There we go, that comes off. So he does actually have in his hand uh, the the chili pepper. You can see it's really little in his hand there. Uh, this is like a weird variant because they released some without the chili pepper in the hand and some with the chili pepper. So yeah, I've got one of the ones with the chili pepper and then they've got all the little things with them. It's got the meth and laboratory stuff and then this meant to look like a tray of meth uh, then we go over here we've got uh, Darlene from um, Mr. Robert this is like th I found this in a shop for four pounds I have to get it because I, I love her glasses and I do like that character and we have the T-Rex from Jurassic Park that's Funko Pop uh, then we have this little Gremlins keyring blind bag um, another Halloween Lego figure um, I forgot Pico? I've, I've completely forgot the name of these ones. I got these so long ago from Kid Robot. That's got the name of those those ones I got. Then we're gonna move up to this top shelf up here. We've got a little ET key ring. Um, Kid Robot. There's a lot of Kid Robot figures up here. Um, there's another Kid Robot figure. Some Adventure Time stuff. Then another Aztec figure. There is a Hostel figure. Uh, another Kid Robot thing. Adventure Time again. Uh, a little cat. Uh, Kid Robot. Garbage Pail Kid. Uh, some more Kid Robot stuff. One of the New Lego Movie 2 figures, which is the lion from The Wizard of Oz. Uh, Spongebob figure, yep, his nose fell off, so it's blue tacked on annoyingly. Uh, Patrick, I think these are Kubrick ones again. Um, some weird Coca-Cola figure, Happy Tree Friends figure. Uh, then some other random little figures and Kid Robot. So that's all this. That's all that shelf. That is that shelf. Done. Uh, now we're going to move on to some more stuff, which is over here. Here we go. So we have Leatherface. Um, I think this is the next figure. Um, this is really, this one I, I paid about eight pound for it when I first got it. Um, this does, this is quite expensive now if you wanted to get it. No, then with these are the new um, Steamboat Willy figures that have been released recently by Disney. Um, these are some Star Wars figures, um, Star Wars Pez, uh, Wally, and Lego, which is awesome. My girlfriend got me this for our anniversary before. Um, here's the one I was talking about. You can see the Mini Mates. And that's Jan, yeah, Jan Sally Bob Clerks, that's the Clerks one. There you go, black and white versions of them. Um, some Jurassic World, Pez, uh, Mecha Godzilla, there we go, Funko Pop Godzilla, uh, then a little Godzilla. Then we've got a Nano Blocks dinosaur, which I forgot me for Christmas. Love that. Um, then we've got Gremlins, reaction figure, Stripe again. Um, well, it's meant to be Cinema Gremlin. No, so it's not Stripe, no, it's just Cinema Gremlin. Um, then we've got some Pacific Rim figures. I think that one, that one was no, knife head. Um, you can see before, there's some there's some Freddy Freddy spitballs back there as well. There was another Jurassic World Pez. Got Chucky Chucky bobblehead. Oh, do not fall over. Uh, salad fingers. Some weird zombie bobblehead I got. My mum got me this this, this ornament. I'm, I'm not sure what exactly is going on, but she got me that for Christmas. It does have a does have a bum. There we go. If you wanted to ever see see something like that, uh, then we got this duck. Uh, the X-ray figures. They've, um, and this is Milk House from Tattoo Dave. Release that. Um, there's a labbit there. We've got Freddy. Uh, some <laughs> wind-up head dinosaur. I put some glasses on him. Uh, look, there's my in my pin collection as well. This isn't really figures, but there's my pins if you want to see those. Don't think I ever showed. I don't know if I ever showed that. But I bought some from a charity shop, five pounds. Look at those dogs. Over to the final bit now, up here. Um, don't know if this isn't really going to go with figures, but I own a lot of plush stuff as well. So we do have labbits and 
the Monsters University stuff. And this is my favourite new thing I got recently. It's a Cause figure they released. I bought a lot of the. I've got my government got me a lot of the clothes of theirs as well, which we released. It's Big Bird Cause. Uh, look at that. Look how cool he is. Like that, and then there's <laughs> lots of random stuff around here. Yeah, here we go. There's a. There's an old Bucky O'Hare. Very good as well. Which I was at Toycon the other week, and people were there's some new Bucky O'Hare figures of people have made, but they're like fifty pound for them. But look at the price I paid for that three euros. Um, then up here is the stuff that I've spent a bit more on, not all of it, but some of it. Um, first off, we've got the leather face again. This is in the packaging, and um, this is just I don't know what series this is. Yeah, Movie Mani Maniacs they released at one point. Um, got that the got Pennywise. The new It, uh, Strange Things, uh, this is the Funko figures they released, the Demigorgon in there, um, got that yesterday, it's one of the newest things I've bought, um, we've got Stripe from Gremlins, it's the new NECA, NECA figure, figure the ultimate, ultimate Stripe, and you do have Gizmo up there with all his, look all his little heads he's got, got loads of different stuff with him which is really cool, you didn't really show the heads of Pennywise one, but there's a lot of stuff here, the little boat as well. I don't take these are the ones I don't take out of the boxes because I like I like having them in them in their boxes. I'm trying to just show you a bit more. Because the light is showing too much on it. But like, it's got a little skateboard with him and stuff as well. Gizmo has so much stuff with him. Um it's got like a candy cane, a little fire thing that he does, trumpet, Christmas hat, three different faces to change, and there's a button on the back of his head where his eyes can flip around. Uh, up there, we've got creatures from the back, the Goon Bobblehead, Green Goblin Bobblehead, uh, we've got a Hit Girl, Lou and Dead doll, um, got that very long time ago, and then we have Canada from Akira, um, this is this is the figure I've spent the most on, um, can't really see him, but this has a lot of stuff, let me see if I can focus on him properly, you can see him a little bit now, there we go. So he has lots and lots of stuff with him. Uh, there's some other little Funko Pops down here as well. Here's one figure I forgot to show. The Morlock from Time Machine. It's done by uh, Monstars. Love the Time Machine and I'm so glad someone released a figure of one of the Morlocks. That is my figure collection. Um, I know it's probably not as, a, as big a collection as many other people have but I like the stuff I have I do keep collecting a lot of stuff I, that to me looks like a lot like that all over there looks like a lot and then got my nice little setup of all the other new stuff that I've recently got I started buying all those the Grem like my girlfriend got me the Gremlins one first for Christmas and then I Stripe bought Stripe yesterday Pennywise I love that one NECA are releasing some top notch stuff at the moment but um, if you've enjoyed this give it a like uh, leave a comment if you want to see more stuff like this, or figure updates, or any sort of stuff, or see about my pins that I said about, um, or anything, anything in this room. I have a big collect I have collections of many, many things, um, but leave a comment if you want to see more stuff like that. Thank you very much, and I will see you all again very, very soon. Goodbye.